Hello, Plano ISD families. I'm excited to announce a change that's underway at our high schools. Starting this fall, all 910 campuses are going to be vertically aligned with their senior high counterparts. That means that we're unifying our mascots, our colors, and celebrating together as Wildcats, Panthers, and Wolves. We heard your feedback about the unique challenges our high school structure currently places on student engagement, and we believe that this is the step in the right direction. By branding the comprehensive 9 through 12th grade experience, we're promoting a sense of unity for our Plano IC students and our community. We want to make sure that everyone feels not only a strong sense of belonging, but great school pride. We believe this change will also enhance student engagement, increase participation, while recognizing that some of our high school student athletes already are competing at the senior high level. So get ready to roar or howl with pride and excitement as Wildcats, Panthers, and Wolves, we can't wait to see the entire district come together as one big Plano ISD family and one big team. Hi, my name is AJ McRowers. Yo, Perez. Kayla Dreyer. And I'm heading to high school next year. Looks like I'm going to be a Wildcat. I'm a Panther. Plano West Wolf sooner than I expected. What's that all about? It's about tradition. It's about unity. What does it mean to be a Wildcat? It means everything. It was a special time. I've been an alumni for 41 years. I started out a Wilson Ram. I was a Shepherd Patriot, a Haggard Eagle, a Weatherford Warrior, a Vines Viking, but I finished a Wildcat. And what I learned in these buildings behind us, more so than in books, I learned tenacity, I learned community, I learned legacy, a winning tradition. We have a song at Plano called the March of Grandioso. And at the end of the song, the entire Wildcat Nation will stand up and yell, Go Cats Go! What does that mean? It means that anything that lies before you, you can overcome and achieve. No matter how far in the future, you'll always be a Wildcat and you'll always be able to achieve and overcome and conquer. So Go Cats Go! I'm Casey Prince and I'm a proud graduate of the first graduating class at Plano West. And when I came to Plano West, I got to be on a committee where I got to help choose the mascot and the colors for Plano West. And I got to stand up in front of the school and make my case for why we should be the wolves and have royal blue, black, and white as our colors. And so it's cool today that that was chosen. And when I come back to the football games, I see everybody standing with their W and their wolves. And I see the drill team still performing some of the same things that we started back when I was here in 2001. There's a lot of pride that comes with being a member of the wolf pack. And it's gonna be so great that these ninth and 10th grade students, they get to join in with all the traditions that were started way back in 2000 and they get to join in them soon. So I'm looking forward to seeing all these new students raising up their W's at all these football games, and go Wolves. Hi, my name is Roy Woods. I'm a 37-year Plano East alum. I grew up in the city of Plano. I went to Christie Elementary, Carpenter Middle School, and attended Clark High School. I then had a choice between Plano Senior High as well as Plano East, and I chose the Black and Gold, the greatest high school in the city of Plano. As a student athlete, I learned so much at, uh, as being a student athlete at Plano East uh, commitment. Uh, discipline and how to handle success as well as family and togetherness and I see vertical alignment as doing the same as bringing everybody together as a family. But as of today it's a great day to be a Panther and we love that flack and gold. Man it starts it with the kindergartners it starts you know, with the with the young kids and opening car doors at elementary schools and and uh, you know having summer camps where we get a chance to get to know those kids and build relationships with those kids and then you get into the middle school and the high school level where we want to introduce them to sports and athletics and in the in the things that they're passionate about it could be CTE band drill whatever that may be but what an opportunity we have to to make connections with them and, and that's our goal when we think about unity we're talking about connection in 1977 we started our current alignment the 9, 10, 11, 12 grade alignment. Uh, it was good at the time, but I really feel like it's changed since then. In my opinion, we need to go back to the traditional type of grade alignment, that's 9 through 12. The reason for that is kids want to be wildcats, panthers, or wolves, even at the ninth grade level. They don't want to wait till the 11th grade year. And I think it'll really be good for kids. And that's what it's all about, our kids and what they the experiences they have 
and they should be able to enjoy that from the ninth through 12th grade, being maroon and white, black and gold, black and blue, uh, for four years, not just two years. At by, you know, everybody chasing that, that dream of being a Wildcat, a Panther or a Wolf, that, that we're gonna create great unity and, and everybody's gonna be on the same team. And, and uh, we're excited, we feel like that, that, um, that it's gonna create a lot of enthusiasm and excitement. Uh, as we're all one team working in the same direction, working together. We are Plano ISD proud. Count me in.